Welcome back to another episode of The Space, a mindfulness podcast that's not like the others. I'm Casey Donovan, together with Amy Malloy. Every weekend we share a special bonus episode with a mindfulness tip to renew, revive and feel alive. It's Mother's Day tomorrow if you're in Australia or America. If it's not Mother's Day where you are, then don't worry. This mindfulness tip is for all mums and all grown-ups any day of the year. Every parent knows that raising children is both the greatest and the toughest role of your lifetime. COVID has also taken a toll on parents and caregivers. Childcare went out the window. People are cut off from their support systems. This Mother's Day, more than ever, we have to hand it to the mothers and the mother figures in our lives. You're just amazing. You don't have to take our word for it. This mindfulness tip can help you to believe it. Motherhood can really bring out your inner mean mum. This is according to Amy Taylor Cabaz, the creator of Happy Mama Movement and the author of the book Mama Rising. The inner mean mum voice goes something like this. You feel like you're not good enough. You feel like you're not doing enough. You cling to everything you believe you're doing wrong. Add in social isolation and life can feel like a bully. You have to work on reprogramming that inner mean mum, says Amy. Instead of hearing that inner mean voice over and over again, you can replace it with compassion. So how do you start? The fact is, most mothers, carers, mother figures and parents overlook the basic but amazing things they do on a daily basis. Understanding why your child is upset. Knowing how to comfort a sick kid. Packing a lunchbox one-handed whilst holding a baby. None of these things seem insta-worthy enough. For a few minutes, make a list in your head. Answer these questions, says Amy. What are you great at? What do you like about yourself? It doesn't have to be a long list. You can also start with the smallest things. I'm good at talking about my feelings. I'm good at finding things in the dark. I'm good at talking my friends down from a crisis. I'm good at co-parenting with my ex-partner. That last one isn't a small thing. Try it as a type of gratitude practice for the next few mornings. When you wake up, think of a few things you like about yourself. You're going to feel stronger and prouder, says Amy. Every time you recognise a special thing you do without even realising it. Sure, it's nice to get a card for Mother's Day or some chocolates. It's also pretty awesome to give love to yourself. I'm Casey Donovan and you've been listening to The Space. We're back on Monday with another mood-boosting topic. Forget your inner critic. Is your inner softie doing you any favours? Until then, space out. <laughs>